Hello, hello everybody. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Gomez Aviation and today I have for you the unboxing of the models that I shopped, that I purchased at the Chicago Collectible Show. So we're going to get uh, started here and I hope you guys like it. I have a uh, terminal map from Kansas City, which Kansas City is where we're going to be going for the Airliners International. So I hope to see a bunch of people there. And um, I got five models, I believe. And I have I got a free Away United Amenity Kit, which I think is pretty cool. So it was completely free. And I got some playing cards. So I think that's pretty cool. So let's get started. All right, guys. So we're going to start here with the terminal map that I mentioned. This is for the Kansas City Airport, which is, like I said, where Airliners International 2024 will be. So it, has, it was nice. So it has a bunch of information there. So I got these. United Airlines playing cards. So pretty cool. And this is a free away United amenity kit that I got for free. I didn't have to pay for it. So inside it we have a lip balm. And you can see right here that says United Polaris. So pretty cool. If nobody knows, if anyone doesn't know what Polaris is, it's United's... Um, first class business class to on long haul flights so here's a coupon in case you want to you know get it for your house it comes with some earplugs and it comes with of course dental kit because we got to keep, keep our teeth clean right especially on long flights because you want to keep the mouth clean so and of course it comes with it says my united journey so it says away and it has the united logo here so it is a mask so you can sleep at night or day or however you want to use it so that's basically it that's what comes in this packet so it's neat to have to have it because like i said it's free so i appreciate it so now we're gonna go ahead and put this to the side and get the start with the models that i got so first up we have this baby bus models which is air classics so it's your typical box no special box or anything so it is a one to four hundred scale i'm gonna fix the camera right here really quick okay so this model it's the jet blue blue I don't know how to say that. Blue. Pluriqua. Anyway, you guys understand, sort of, right? But anyway, this is the model. It is an Airbus A320. So I've wanted this model since I saw it come out. And um, I believe Gemini Jets had done it as well but anyway i've never really came to it but hey now i have it in my collection and it's pretty nice so in the tail we have like a kite or well, kites actually and then we have a registration here n779jb the american flag so up next, we have, I'm going to put this to the side, the NG models Boeing 737 Southwest in the New Mexico 1 livery. So NG does make the special box designs for their um, boxes, which I think is pretty cool. And um, we're going to go ahead and open it. This is a 1 to 400 scale. And, of course, we have the NG code for the points. Has anybody redeemed points for, for a free model? I haven't. I was looking to the one that, that recently, recently came up. 
but I I didn't like anything. So I'm holding out on my point so I can get something that I really like or that I really want. So here's the model. I think it's way too yellow actually. It might just be me though. I don't know. But I think I see it like a bright yellow. But nonetheless, it's very nice actually. So anyway, up here we have the New Mexico One title. And then we have the what consists of the New Mexico um, flag, which other Southwest Airlines liveries that are state liveries have the current, you know, state, whatever it's representing, it has the, the flag of that state. So we have the current um, tail for Southwest. So it's very nice. I like the Southwest um, liveries because, in my opinion, they're pretty cool. Um, plus, who doesn't love Southwest, right? So here's another model that I've really wanted and that I've been working. It's the Latin Classics, which is... Um, classics from latin america i guess you can say <laughs> but anyway so these are pretty nice um this is the mexicana airbus a319 so if any if, if you guys don't know mexicana de Vision was um an airline that existed but went bankrupt but um Apparently, it's coming back. The president wants to bring it back. But anyway, I want to get all the Mexicana liveries because I want to make my airport in a retro livery. I mean, retro livery. I'm sorry, in a retro time where all the Mexicana livery, uh, planes were here and stuff. So anyway, we have the big, bright Mexicana titles right here. I like the engines. On the wings, we have Mexicana, which was called Mexicana de Aviación. And right here is the registration, N750MX. And right here on top says, Vamos por todo. I don't know if you guys can see it, which means, let's go for everything. And this livery, oh my God, this tail livery, it's beautiful. So I have more Mexicana de Aviación models which you've probably seen here if you know you follow my channel the following model is the alaska seattle kraken livery it is a 737 max 9 this is by gemini jets so standard gemini jets livery nothing you know you can pause this to read if you want but um it's the typical gemini jets box nothing different here's the model we're gonna go ahead and open it up oh nice <laughs> i have quite a lot of um alaska models in my collection i believe i have like i want to say 24 or so and i'm still missing some but anyway we have the Alaska titles right here. Seattle Kraken. Kraken, Kraken. This is a mass, uh, a max, so we have the nice engines right here. We have Chester in the in the tail. We have the liver the um, the registration. So it's pretty nice. I like it. I like all the I've well, I like all the special liveries, but I've never flown a special livery for any type of airline for any southwest any alaska airlines any american united delta any type of airline that has any sort of um special livery i haven't flown all the airlines air canada and everything that i've flown has always been the standard livery so sometimes i wonder what's going to be my first ever special livery but anyway we're going to go ahead and continue with the video because we don't want it to be that long. So that's the fourth model right here with these, the Alaska Airlines. Anyway, did you guys hear that Alaska is buying 
Hawaiian Airlines. How crazy is that? The 49th state and the 50th state combining together. That's crazy. We'll see how it, everything unfolds as time goes on. But anyway, let's continue. And then the final model that I got, it's a very anticipated model. It is the Delta Airlines Embraer 175. We finally got it, guys. So I know some people are going to get more than one, but I only need one. I'm very happy I got it, though. So you can pause that to read some info about the, the 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 plane so here's how much I paid in case you guys are wondering there you go all right how many of you were excited for this model huh and how many of you got it already wow you know that feeling when you get something you wanted and you finally get it that's that feeling right now right about now that's that feeling i have so is it focusing oh man i hope i was focusing through the whole video i didn't notice till now i hope it did so anyway here's the the model oh my god it's not focusing i think it's focused now Okay, I think it's full. Yeah. So this is the Embraer 175 from Delta Airlines. It's, it's so tidy, but it's so nice. Oh, look at that. Gemini jets fixed the horrible wing flex that these jets had. Wow. That's very cool. I thought we were going to get like we had it for the United Airlines one. I don't know if you guys remember that. It came with it was horrible. So this one's pretty nice. Okay, okay, I like it. Gemini Jet's been improving. That's good. I like that. But anyway, guys, I want to thank you all so much for taking the time to look at my video and um, you know, subscribe and like my stuff. So. I want to mention something before the video ends. I am very, very close on um, getting to gold status on United Airlines. I am currently a silver member, which um, I've been for three years, I believe. And I'm so close to achieving gold status. And I just might. So if I end up achieving gold status i will make a video for it and um i'm excited because you get more benefits and stuff but i'll explain all that in a new video but anyway guys thank you so much for watching the video and please consider subscribing sharing and liking and remember may god bless all of you i hope you guys have a good rest of your day and enjoy your weekend and I'll see you in the next video.